This is the project called Amazon Quest. And Amazon Quest is an extraordinary project. I can't say I really understand it. This has been one of the most challenging expeditions yet for the Quest team. They've had to battle all kinds of deadly animals like piranhas and stingrays and biting little turtles. And of course, then has been the scratchy, itchy little mosquitoes buzzing around your head and biting and biting. And oh, it's just been absolutely terrible. It's scratching. Oh, I can't stand it even thinking about it. Oh, my God. The Amazon Quest expedition has not been without its mishaps, I must say. It's been very dangerous and there have been terrible near misses. The Quest team is loved by indigenous people all over the Amazon. And in fact, wherever they go, they're greeted by the same wonderful cheer. <laughs> Despite the challenges the Amazon Quest team has been through, they always manage to look quite good. They have lovely little outfits they wear all the time, some of them kind of strange. They're rather nice looking young people. It's the monkey accessory. You can wear it with your day clothes, with an evening gown. It's just, I don't know, it just gives you a certain je ne sais quoi. One of the most brilliant performances on Amazon Quest was that of Nick Butner, who of all things plays a monkey. I had the most extraordinary opportunity to sit down with him and have an intimate chat about his skills. Shall we look at that? We're here with the great Shakespearean actor Nick Butner, who has made famous his role as a monkey, working with the great Harry Primate, among others. Now tell us, Nick, how do you prepare for these extraordinarily difficult roles? I have been acting as a primate for a very long time. I started it when I was three years old as a chimp. Worked my way up through Hitchcock, Tarantino. And it's a little known fact, I was nominated for an Oscar for Best Primate in an Action Series. If you don't mind me asking a rather difficult question, does it bother you at all that you have only the monkey mask as opposed to the entire monkey suit? What are you trying to say? No, 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 no. I didn't mean to imply that. It, well, well, I suppose I did when you come right down to it. Shouldn't you be wearing a full monkey suit instead of prancing around in a little hood wearing the Columbia clothing being sort of half monkey? I have never in my life been so insulted. Oh, this is getting out of hand. I'm totally out of hand. Let's go back to the studio. Back to the studio. Get change the cameras. Here. Change the cameras. Hey, you're on. Oh, excuse me, yes, that was a wonderful interview, riveting, absolutely riveting. Now, where were we? Some of the most delightful experiences on the quest come from the music that the Inca used to play, and now the Highland people play too with the lovely panpipes. Let's hear some now. <laughs> excuse me. Well, to sum it up, Amazon Quest has been one adventure after another, absolutely stunning. The writing, the dancing, the singing, the antics, the craziness, it's really been absolutely extraordinary. And be sure to tune in next week when teammate Don Butner says... I'm now officially part of the Amazon River. Well, I'm afraid I really must go now. I, according to my instruments, I've got another 1,500 miles to go to the mouth of the Amazon. It's really quite a long way. So, tally-ho, till next time.